The movie Enemy of the State is getting uncomfortably close to reality for some Americans. First came revelations about warrantless wiretapping. Now the president has given approval for local law enforcement to use spy satellites for criminal investigations. The fear? Potential abuse. I would hope that they would, but, you know, we don't know everything that goes on, so probably not. Civil liberty groups fear the government is crossing the line by using military tools against American civilians. But police want it to be known that they do believe in civil rights for Americans and they will follow any kind of regulations or stipulations when it comes to using this spy equipment on Americans. We always want to make sure that we're doing things on the up and up. As depicted in the movie 1984, any encroachment on Americans' privacy leads some to fear an Orwellian state where the government will eventually know your every move. But retired Air Force three-star general and Vietnam War planner Howard Fish supports using spy satellites here at home. Oh, great. Whatever capabilities are out there that we can use to, to track uh, the terrorists, we ought to use them. That's a no-brainer to my notion. That includes American criminals. He calls those against such efforts mostly anti-war activists. And you know, when you really fundamentally scratch an anti-war activist below the skin, you find out two things. One, they're not only against the war, they're against the military. Whether Americans are for it or against it, by this fall, using spy satellites will likely be a reality in many parts of this country. Jeff Farrell, KSLA News 12 reporting.